scheduled for one fall. Before introducing the participants, please welcome Team International. And there you see the members, the participants of Team International, led by the captain, Gabari, on the far left. It's uh, also Alex Kozlov from Russia, Tyson Dukes from Canada, and Doug Williams from the UK. And also, please welcome Team T in T. Other interested observers for this opening round match, Team TNA, you see the flag in the hands of the Captain Kaz. You see, yes, his partners, Curry Man, as well as Chris Saban and Alex Shelley, the Motor City Machine Guns. This is Team TNA. And ladies and gentlemen, now introducing the participants. First, representing Team Japan, Naruki Doi and Masato Yoshino. It was two weeks ago here on Impact when we were introduced to these Team Japan members in the World X Cup preview against the Motor City Machine Guns. That match defined the No Limits X Division to me. And their opponents representing Team Mexico. Mexico City based CMLL promotion. It is the masked Ultimo Guerrero and his partner Ray Bucanero. They have each wrestled professionally for 17 years, which gives them a huge experience edge against their Team Japan opponents, Doi and Yoshino, who are both eight year pros. Now, both of these tag teams. They regularly wrestle together, and much like Team Japan, Ultimo Guerrero and Rey Bucanero, they have held single, tag team, and six-man championships for the CMLL promotion in Mexico. The experience edge the Team Mexico brings here has got to be a decided advantage as we look at Team TNA and Team International observing this matchup as they're getting into the spirit of things and everybody wanting to see what each team has as this as this World X Cup goes week after week. Doi and Yoshino representing, yes, Team Japan, both 27 years of age. They wrestle for the Dragon Gate promotion over in the Orient. They were trained originally by Ultimo Dragon, and they represent Japan in this opening round tag team match where one point goes to the winning team. Of course, later on the night, it's Booker T, Kevin Nash, and that incredible main event, but look at that speed. Yoshino, the fastest guy, Mike, I have ever seen in the ring here at TNA, and unbelievable how he just went off those ropes and able to catch that boot right in the gut of Ultimo Guerrero. And I caught Ray Bucanero. I mean. As we see now, the double team moves quickly by Team Japan right here, and look at this dot from the top. Here comes Yoshino. Did you see that double foot stomp? Off the top rope while Naruki Doi held out the arm of Ray Bucanero. Uh, just able to get so high in the air and just brings those feet right down on the arms. And now the double team by Team Japan as Bucanero has got to find a way to get Guerrero into the matchup. But you can see they're working so well together. Look at this. Another double team move, drop toe hold, leads to that quick drop kick there that you saw by Yoshino. Naruki Doi on the cover and a two count on Ray Bucanero as we see the other teams also here. Team International and Team TNA looking on with interest. Well, Yoshino just goes over there and takes a cheap shot on Ultimo Guerrero as Bucanero now has to get a tag in. This is a great opportunity here for Team Japan starting out so quick and man, do they work well together. Oh, they sure do. Here comes another double team move as we see the drop kick there. Oh boy. Trouble for Ray Bucanero with that drop kick from Masato Yoshino. Not going to get the tag in yet as we see Yoshino follow up. Quickly shot across into the ropes, and Yoshino is nailed from outside by Ultimo Guerrero, and now there's the tag from Ray Bucanero. Oh, nice move. They were setting up Team Japan, and wow, look at this. Taking them both out at once, and Ultimo Guerrero shows his strength. It's obviously 
He's got the muffler here in Team Mexico. Yeah, Team Mexico double team now. It's Ray Bucanero translated to the king of the Pirates, the Buccaneers, and Ultimo Guerrero, the last warrior. By the way, Ultimo Guerrero, no relation to TNA's Hector Guerrero. Well, this is going to show you how momentum can change so fast. Team Mexico turned this thing around and now dominating Team Japan. And I'll tell you what, they're doing it in a way where they're not allowing Team Japan to use that speed. And look at this combination that Team Mexico has. They're feeling it. They're getting confident. What you got to have here in the World X Cup. I want to remind you that starting next week right here on Impact, we will move into the second round of the World X Cup. Singles matches, one-on-one -on -one bouts with two points to the winner. That starts next week. Double team move here against Yoshino. Well, each round, the points will get more. And wow, nice, nice move there. As Yoshino able to hit that Hurricane run, and then they send Guerrero outside the ring. Wait a minute. Here comes Team Japan. Both of them suicide dives right through the rings and take out Team Mexico simultaneously. Speed muscle. That's the nickname for this Team Japan team as we take another look. Double suicide dive. Well, look how they are. They're just so good together, and they do it perfectly together, time perfectly, and take Team Mexico out now. It seems like the advantage goes back to Team Japan. It's just seen a rookie doy in the ring. Great Bucanero, but man, nice counter by Bucanero. Just overpowered him that time, Don. Set him flying across the ring. Follows up here, tries to charge at him, but you see that Doy's able to move out of the way, and Ray Bucanero tied up in the ropes. Well, now the muscle of Team Japan just gives him those chops right in the chest, and there's the drop kick. And he had his legs in the ropes, and it took him down, and now turning things around, and look at this. You can see Yoshino up top. Oh, can he get some extension? What a kick on Guerrero! Sensational missile drop kick off the top from Naruki Doi. Doi One, with the cover. Two. And no! Well, Team Japan almost picking up a point. Well, I'll tell you what, what cost him was, just, you know, the referee was having him get out of the ring, and by the time they did it, it was able to allow Bucanero to, to get that brush in. What a clothesline, Mike Buck took his head off. Short arm clothesline by Bucanero. Turns things over to Ultimo Guerrero. Gonna try and send him for the ride, but Yoshino turns it around on him. Quickly, Guerrero goes up to the middle rope. Yoshino right there as well with him, trying to fight him off. Guerrero! Look at that front suplex! I'll tell you what, it was like they were suspended in midair, and he brought him right down. Here it is. Oh, broken up at the last second. I thought it was all over. I, I did mean, too. it was poetry in motion up there, Mike. Boy, I thought so, but you saw the save that was made by Japan's Naruki Doi. Guerrero, baseball slide drop kick sends Yoshino out to the floor. Oh, then Bucanero just slides directly across and lands on top of him. Now you got Guerrero and Naruki Doi in the middle of the ring. And you can see Guerrero puts him right there on top of the turnbuckle, kind of crossed him, and now, look at him on those top ropes, trying to get a hold of him, no, oh, man, another wicked move, if they suplexed him back around on his face. And now, tags in, legal man, Ray Bucanero, Ultimo Guerrero, holding Naruki Doi up, and you see the shot directly to the chest, and here comes, from the top, oh, man, Corkscrew Senton, pin, Incredible highlights, folks. What a way for Team Mexico to come out and get that first point. And you got to admit, Team TNA and Team International have to be impressed. No question about that. As we take a look at the highlights of this match with Team Japan in control early, but Team Mexico turns it around in their favor. And that top rope country senton able to give them the victory. And yes, Team Mexico victorious in this second World X Cup first round matchup. So important to get that first point, so important to make that statement. I'll tell you what it really is, you're sending a message let's to up, everybody. Yeah, let's update the standings for you. Mexico's win over Japan, it's now evened up. The 2008 World X Cup, Team TNA, Team Mexico, tied with one point apiece.